and welcome to the latest video guide in this series of video guides to help our users um, navigate the coachingmanual.com. Today we're going to look at season plans. Season plans is the newest feature of the coaching manual, one that we're really excited about. Um, we're, we're pretty confident that this is going to really change how coaches can plan and execute their curriculum for the season. Um, it's designed to, to make coaching really easy for coaches so that they don't have to think too much about what they're supposed to be doing. Um, we've got some really good tried and tested resources that, that, that work in, in football education. So to find season plans, you just type in app.thecoachingmanual.com forward slash season dash plans. Um, or if you go into training ground, you can see there's a link here for season plans. Now, season plans are team coach or club coach uh, features. So if you're a team coach user or a club coach user, you can access season plans. If you're a rec coach user or an unpaid subscriber, then you're going to have to upgrade the subscription. Um, it doesn't cost a lot, though, to get access to the season plans. Uh, pretty sure that the extra couple of dollars a month will be more than made up for in the time that you'll save planning and delivering your coaching sessions. Now, one of the side benefits for season plans is the ability to share content with subscribed players. So we have introduced a paid player subscription and this will allow people to get access to the sessions before they actually come to the coaching session. So in your um, edit function in the club, go in and edit your team so that you can add your players in before you choose a season plan. If you add your players in and they are paid subscribers, then they will be able to watch the videos for every session for the whole season before they come to the training. And in testing, the results have been amazing in terms of improving the amount of um, learning that happens during a session, um, massively reducing the amount of dead time uh, that coaches have We've got to use to, to talk through what's happening in the session um, and the learning outcomes have been have been greatly improved in testing as well so we're really pleased that this works and helps people get what they need out of their season paid subscribers get other benefits as well so they can see skills content you can set them homework and things like that so it's well worth uh, ten dollars a year or dollar a month pound a month to take um, a subscription out okay so let's look at season plans um, like I said, everyone with a team coach or a club coach um, subscription can access season plans. The season plan landing page, if you're being impatient, you can get started straight away. But um, there's also information here to give you a bit more about what season plans are, what they do, how they work, how they've been designed, um, so that we can, we can get the most out of them. But if you've read all the information and you're happy with it, just click Get Started. And then it's quite a simple process to select your season plan. You've got a few questions to answer. And as we go through, we just select the different um, fields. Now, this is an important one because all the season plans are age appropriate. So that all the content that you deliver will be content that has been designed specifically for this age group. And also because of the way that the season plans are periodized, um, we teach different things to different age groups. So at younger age groups, they do very little out of possession work compared to maybe the 12 to 16s or 16 pluses who do a really good mixture of tactical um, as well as technical and um, skill-based work. As at the younger age groups, we do much more in terms of, of controlling um, the ball. So what you do to start off with is you select the start date, second of March, and you then select your end date. Now the season plans are built to cater for people who coach either 10 week, a se 10 week seasons right up to 48 weeks a year um, from one session a week to three sessions a week. Now we know that most people only train once a week um, but we have given the ability for people to add more sessions in. So for this group, I'm going to add in just a one, one session a week for a 12-week season. Click the day that we play, just so that players have got um, their calendar built out. And then we hit Build Session. 
Now it's going to spend a few seconds just generating the season plan and it, it's different for different people depending on the information that they enter. Okay, and here we are, my season plan's been um, delivered. So I can go in and see what I'm supposed to be training next Wednesday. I'll see which days that we play on. Um, we can see it in a, in a calendar view like this so that we can scroll through month by month. Got all of my April sessions, my May sessions, and then of course I selected the, um, the last day of the season at the 24th. So that's the last session that I'm, that I'm coaching. Um, we can see this in list view as well so that I can literally go and look at what I'm doing each week. Um, and the season plan then can be shared with, with my team. So it will go straight into my team and they can use it. So like I said, season plans are a um, feature for team coaches and club coaches. If you're a rec coach, upgrade for a month, try it out, see what you think. Um, pretty sure that you'll be um, really impressed with it um, and it will really help your coaching. So if you need any more set, uh, help with, with parts of the coaching manual, check out the help center www.thecoachmanual.com forward slash help dash center or um, look out for further videos as they appear on YouTube. Thank you very much.